The Ghost Storm technology has been fully researched, Pathfinder. Excellent. We're ready to make our push on Meridian, then. I'll call a meeting immediately. Prepping VidCon communications. The Nexus leaders think our search for Meridian is a waste of time, but we know they're wrong. Turning on vaults won't be enough without the heart of the system. Just to clarify, you're defying a direct order? It's my job to bring us home, and that's what I'm doing. With or without permission. Ha <laughs> ha, that's the spirit. And the kit? That's where the Ghost Storm technology comes in. Isn't that right, Hager? Exactly. Our forged signals should divert some cat from you. It won't be all of them, but it'll be enough. The Tempest is small and fast. I don't need a big window. We'll drop you off and make our exit before the cat catch on. Once we're on Meridian, it'll be a small team. Move fast, figure out its secrets. Right behind enemy lines. Good time to assess their numbers, defenses. And when you're ready, we'll extract you the same way we got you in. If we come back with actuals on Meridian, the Nexus will sit up. Sounds like a solid plan, team. Hager, you ready? Good to go on your word, Pathfinder. All right, guys, this is it. Let's get moving. Maybe bone up on the uniform protocol, Liam. Subsection shirts. Civilian ship. What will they do? Dump my pay? We get paid. Why? Archon's information is right. This is the system. Meridian should be here somewhere. Anomaly detected. Deploying probe. Anomaly found. I'm picking up something. a huge mineral deposit. Anomaly on sensors. Probe away. Satellite detected.
That's it. That's Meridian. Or Kitasira, as the Keth call it. Looks like a giant space station. Ghost storm on my mark. Three, two, go. Enemy signature detected. Commence pursuit. Hager, it's working. Reading a bunch of cat headed our way. Pulling back. It's all on you now, Tempest. We should get them as close as possible to here. Intense readings could be some kind of control center. No decent landing sites. This could get messy. How messy? Ryder, looks like a flyby is our only option. I'll get as low as possible, but you'll have to eject over the target area. I've fallen out of so many things now, I should be a pro. Heard about your freefall to Habitat 7. Liam said he could hear you screaming the whole way down. Keep it buttoned this go-round, huh? It's embarrassing. All right, you know the drill. What's your rate of descent? Shield should take care of the rest. So far, so good. The cat haven't detected us. But once we go in, we'll be clear as day to any troops on the ground. Don't worry about us. Just make sure you and the Tempest get out safe. Loud and clear. I bumped my head, but I'm good. We'll need to survey the area, figure out what we're dealing with. I am detecting active conduits nearby. Your scanner should be picking them up. It's raining. How is it raining? Are you sure it's rain? Is it even water? Pathfinder, while interacting with that console, I detected the presence of a complex network connected via a central command hub. A hub? You mean we found Meridian's controls? Most likely. However, the hub is dark. Deactivated. Let's see what Meridian's all about. We can start by finding its central hub. central command hub I detected earlier. As with the monoliths and vaults, the hub is connected to the two neighboring towers. So activating the towers will also activate the command hub. So we could bring Meridian online right now? Forget scouting, let's do that. And the cat? Activating a vault has previously activated a purification field. Perhaps Meridian is similar. Let's head to those towers and see what we can find. Pathfinder, interfacing with that console has activated a gravity well. Look at this place. It's amazing. Pathfinder, I'm picking up radio interference, a cat signal. Alert! The detect signal was a decoy. Key to zero has been infiltrated. All units are to focus on incapacitation and capture of the Pathfinder. At least we got a little bit of a head start.
I wonder if there's a broken ammo processor somewhere that's causing this downpour. I'm just glad it's rain and not, for example, Corrosive acid. Income. Ah. Right, so command hub. Probably need to check out those other two towers first. Sam, what do you think? Intense vortexes of scourge energy. I would steer clear if I were you, Pathfinder. I'm kicking myself for not bringing breadcrumbs. That's... I don't even get these readings. What happened here? Detecting high levels of scourge energy. That pillar looks familiar. We've been here before, right? No. Maybe I'm thinking of that pillar. Huh. This remnant took the cat to the cleaners. Probably deserved it. Else. I don't know. I think they're cute. Except for the shooting part. <sighs> I wish we didn't have to rush around defending ourselves from Ket. It would be nice to take our time and really look at this stuff. Energy's off the charts here. Pathfinder, it appears the energy waves from these craters contributed to the scourge throughout Helios. So whatever happened here caused the scourge to erupt all across the cluster? Yes, Pathfinder. How? Did the remnant builders trigger the scourge? Or someone attacked them with it? I'm surprised the cat haven't taken this place apart trying to discover its secrets. Look 
Look at all this remnant stuff. It's like my birthday. Detecting low levels of power, Pathfinder. A scan may help identify conduits. Still okay? Damage to parts of the system are preventing power up. Can we reroute past the damage? That may work, Pathfinder. Boosting trace signals. Some kind of glyph on this thing. Looks like part of some kind of pattern. So far, so good. Let's see about rerouting the power past all the damage. Hmm, huh, good choice. Provisional repairs are complete, Pathfinder. Only one way to know for sure. Translating. Flight control systems online. Welcome, Administrator. I don't like this. We should get out of here. Restoring the systems appears to have reactivated something else nearby. I can see that, Sam, and I don't think it's good. Look at it. It's like one of those derelicts we've seen. Only... no longer derelict. Translating. Exploration vessels on standby. We have seen remnant ships, but none in working condition. It says it cannot retrieve commands from the Meridian engine. Hmm. Meridian engine? Sam, do you know what? They're going to be trouble. Restoring power woke up the remnant. <laughs> Ryder, I detect a surge of energy on the scans. The section you're in lit up like Mardi Gras. Then remnant have crap Mardi Gras parades. What's going on? Are you all... Can't talk right now! Security's down. We're good here. The Ken are probably waiting out there for us. So stay alert. Got it. Turned on, it's pretty incredible, isn't it? One tower down. We'll need the other one to access the command hub.
Look at all those lights. Can you imagine what this was like when it was all working with the builders here? And what do you imagine a builder looks like? Tall, glowy, or maybe short and round and glowy. You're kind of fixated on the glowy, aren't you? What's in it for the Ket if we activate Meridian? The Archon's forces have been here for years, and they're nowhere close to being able to understand about the tech. No one. Watch out! Bridge is down! Hostile shuttle. One tower left. It's like a damn forest in here. Those builders were great at growing plants in weird places. Activate both to reach Meridian's core. Cat down below. We've got a height advantage, Rider. Lot of cat equipment. Looks like they set up camp. I detect working remnant technology. We could turn that against them.
giant mushrooms? What is this place? Someone get the lights? What the hell? Translating. Pattern 1-3. Viability, 56.2%. Genetic template transmitted for testing. Were they performing experiments on them? Running an analysis on the glyphs. These bodies are prototypes from genetic blueprints, each more refined than the last. Using Meridian, they designed a species that would live in this cluster. The Angara. They created... life? Then everything we've seen, we were just scratching the surface. Where they come from doesn't change who the Angara are now. They're still the same people. So Meridian is not just about terraforming. It's capable of creating life. But why do something like this? I can say nothing about the Remnant Builder's ultimate purpose. They created life. The Archon could twist that around, destroy life. Look at this tech. The Builders intended Meridian to do great things. To advance science, not be used as a weapon. But the system still has destructive capabilities. We'd better get to those controls. If we crack Meridian's controls first, we make sure the Archon can't use it. We have to tell Jal what we learned here, right? I know. We'll tell Jal, and let him decide how to spread the news to his people. I bet the Archon knows about the Angara. That's why he's so... We should be good to get into the command hub. All right, two towers going. Should get us into Meridian's main control room. Organism appears to be held in. everything set up to study this place. Hey! You, Ken! Get away from our remnant stuff! 
What do you think we're going to find? No idea, but that looks like a gravity well. Pathfinder, I am quickly building a workable database of the Remnant language. We have not encountered instances of it in such abundance before. in central command it's amazing finally whoa i think we saw that from space wonder what's in there
Translating. Connection lost. Meridian engine not found. Sam, is there damage here? Can we restore systems like we did before? I'm sorry, Pathfinder. Systems are intact, but they are searching for a component that doesn't appear to exist. What do you mean, doesn't appear to exist? One moment, Pathfinder. I have found something. Translating. Final administrator log. The opposition's weapon may cause widespread damage. All our weapons, our ships, will not be able to protect us. Protect my goal. We need to disengage Meridian from Command Core, which will remain here to draw fire. Meridian contains all the work of the Jardin. Nothing else matters. I will send it far. We can return one day. Continue the process of renewal. End of log. So, this isn't Meridian. <laughs> the Archon was wrong. <laughs> That's funny. I mean, it's horrible. But it's funny the asshole had no idea. We'll be able to bring it back, right? They'll destroy this tower and everything in it! Get ready. We're getting out of here. Sam, find me another exit, away from the cat! There is no other exit, Pathfinder. However, the Remnant City is not without defenses, and this is its central command. Remnant defenses? Of course. Use them against the cat! wants that one. Destroy the rest. Watch your backs. It's one of those that can cloak. Not getting past me. Cloak or no cloak. For. We saw everything from orbit. It was incredible. The entire city lit up. The scans went wild. And Ryder? The Ket are retreating. Whatever you did, it worked. 
They got the ass kicking they needed. Hand delivered by us. Given your command over the Remnant's defenses, Pathfinder, I predict the Ket will not attempt to recapture the city. Any progress on Meridian? Have you got it working yet? This isn't Meridian. Or at least not all of it. Hard to explain. We'll brief you later. So Meridian's gone. But shouldn't this thing know the nav point of where it went? Contact with the Scourge will have altered Meridian's original path. It would take countless years to determine its current location. All this remnant tech around us? The Jardin had to have a plan. Did they have time for a plan? Well, if the Scourge is messing things up, maybe that's where we should look. At what? I don't know yet. We'll have to think about it. Okay, no Meridian. But we kicked the Ket out of a major stronghold. That's huge. That just means we need to push forward before they can recover. We have to find Meridian. The real one. Sam, collect all the data you can. Radio the Tempest for extraction. This is going to take work. And it's going to take all of us. Pathfinder, you seem well. We're all doing quite well here. Thank you. That is good to hear. This journey can't have been easy. Speaking of which, we know you defied us. You went for Meridian in direct violation of initiative orders. Even though our reasons were quite clear. Yet, you were correct, Ryder. We should have trusted your instincts. You have proven time and again that you deserve the title of Pathfinder. I have never been so glad to be wrong. I appreciate your encouragement, and your candor. I am told there are still obstacles to reaching Meridian. The initiative stands ready to provide whatever support you need. Pathfinder, if you're done with your call to the Nexus, I'd like to talk to you. I think I've found a way for us to find Meridian. Nighter processing the data we received from the Remnant City. It's a lot. Don't push yourself too hard. Someone's gotta keep me pretty. It's not like being a created species really means anything. The Angara are the Angara. What matters in the end is that they exist. We can talk more later. Sure. Pathfinder, thought you might be callow. I asked him for nav data. Data for what? Mapping the Scourge. Now we know it's a weapon, I hate it more. Designed to isolate, lingers well after the war. I know what that is, it's a minefield. They're vile. Because it's not just about watching your step. They make normal life impossible. You get it. The long-term point is to hobble the way the whole population lives. Mark this. The Ket are bad, but whoever deployed the Scourge, they're some motherfuckers. Hello, Scott. Have you come to see if I'm finally broken? To see what discovering that my people were invented 
has done to me? Just here if you need to talk. I can't imagine what you're feeling. I've been staring out the window, trying to figure that out. That's new. True. Angara are usually very free with our feelings. Not talking about all Angara. I'm talking about you. I'm... numb. I'm... in awe. There's a peace in knowing that... though the universe is beyond your understanding, it doesn't need your understanding to function. That you may even have a... hidden destiny. Does it matter? Your people aren't shackled to this new discovery. I agree. We don't owe anything to the Jardin. Our destiny is our own. I'm not broken, Ryder. I'm excited. The Angara were created for a purpose. We were given vaults and golden worlds. All these advanced tools. And there is nothing the Ket can do about it. The future holds more for the Angara than a never-ending war on the Ket. Much more. For the Angara? Hell, for all of us. These are amazing, crazy days. <laughs> really crazy. Really amazing. It doesn't matter if we were created by a god. Reborn from our ancestors, or exist as the dream of an AI superpower. This discovery changes nothing. Except... ourselves. And that's... everything. So my buddy Jill, who, by the way, can't stop singing your praises, wants to have a baby. And, uh, stop me if you've heard this one before, she asked me if I'd father it. And that's something to joke about? No. I don't know. Yes? Why the hell not? That's a big deal, Gil. Maybe the biggest deal. You, more than anyone, should know that. Why? Because my dad wasn't around. My mom did a great job, Ryder. I love my life. Then what are you doing here? If your life was so great, why did you leave it 600 years behind? I don't know. I told you, not much thought went into it. I didn't really think it through. Unless you want to do the same thing here, I suggest you treat this with the gravity it deserves. I hear you. And you know I've been thinking about it, Ryder. Becoming a dad. I don't want to just be a donor. Bringing a kid into the world wouldn't be enough for me. I'd want to raise the child with Jill. Sounds like you know what you want. Yeah. It's funny, you can think until you're blue in the face. Sometimes you just gotta trust your gut. I'm very happy for you, Gil. For both of you. Thanks, Ryder. Or should I say, Uncle Pathfinder. Hey, Ryder. What are we going to do if Meridian isn't what we expect? What do you mean? What if it isn't where it's supposed to be? Or it doesn't work the way we think it does? Let's not worry about things we don't know yet. It's just we never really know what we're going to get with this remnant stuff. I've been going back and forth. Glee one second, worry the next. If it sounds too good to be true, it usually is. Learn that the hard way. The hard way is how we win. Every time something goes wrong, we learn a little more. More about the cat, more about the remnant. It's never a waste. Whatever happens, let's try to have fun doing it. Haven't we so far? Two galaxies worth. That Archon barely sees us as sentient, strings people up like puppets. Didn't know Sam could do that to his Pathfinder. You sure you're okay? 
Just a lingering bruise or two. My vitals are good. Let's hope that sample he took isn't a problem. Losing another Pathfinder is... <sighs> At least the Kit can't exalt the Krogan. Sorry, rambling. Did you need me? See you later, Cora. I'll be here. It's my night off. I don't remember approving that. I can break bones just as well as I can mend them, Pathfinder. What are you reading? Harry's latest report on Sarah. She's restless, but on the mend. So you're not really taking the night off? <laughs> Work-life balance has never been my strong suit. You love what you do. Nothing wrong with that. Tell that to my exes. How do you do it? Be both Scott and the Pathfinder. Pathfinder, Doctor, they're just titles, not who we are. I don't know who I am if I'm not a doctor. You're only what, 200 years old? You've got time to find out. I'm in engineering. We're going to some dangerous places, buddy. Hang in there. Hello, Scott. I have been contemplating our discoveries about the Angara at the Remnant City. I know who created me, and I know my purpose. I have also experienced not knowing. The difference is immense. You're heading into some deep waters there, Sam. Whole lifetimes are spent asking about creation, its meaning, if it has one, and if there was a motivating force. Are you asking if there's a god? AI have concrete answers about why they exist. If I did not, I would look for them. Thanks, Sam. Nothing more. A nightcap for you. When you're ready, call and I'll come running. With a surprise. PB. PB? I'm ready for my surprise. Come. Join me. Oh, no, no. You don't give the orders here. Whose surprise is this, anyway? Maybe that's the surprise. Even on your back, you keep me on my toes. Let's reenact how we met. Do you know about... Asari melding? Our bodies and minds weave together, become one. I've never trusted anyone enough. Never trusted myself. I've got you. You're safe with me.
I can't believe it. It's so quiet. We are one. This is all ours now. great before, but that was just the tip of the iceberg. This now means so much more. This is where I belong. Extremely quick thinking for a human. You saw the perfect drop zone just in time. Well, we humans get lucky sometimes. I'm glad to have that kind of luck on my flight deck. That's what the Salarian Ark was worth to our officers? Thousands of lives for maybe a future advantage against the Kit? You're a better person than I, Ryder. I'd have toasted Adin in our thruster exhaust. But at least the dead and their families have some justice. Need anything else? I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Finder. Just the person I wanted to see. Meridian. Set on a path its creators. Disrupted by the Scourge. Now lost. An unmanned ship is at the mercy of ocean currents. Now, think of Meridian as the ship, and the Scourge as the ocean. If we can somehow predict the currents and track them, we could figure out where the ocean's taken the ship. At best, that just narrows down the range of possible locations. It's better than nothing. Dr. Anwar's suggestion may indeed be our best chance at finding Meridian. The more we know about the Scourge, the better we can predict how it affects the things it comes in contact with. We'll need better data. Probes for the Scourge and Garen star charts. The Initiative made charts of Helios from the Milky Way 600 years back. Perfect baseline. I can compare that to Helios at present. It'll give us numbers, but one set won't be enough. Sam, what exactly do we need right now? Readings from within the Scourge itself, collected by probes planted at key points. Once enough data is collected, we'll need initiative resources for mining and analysis. Once that is done, I can build a predictive model that will recalculate Meridian's path. We have a plan. Now let's make it work. Everyone's counting on us. Let's bring them home. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. Intense scourge activity is common in this area. Might be worth planting a probe. Arrived at a scourge nav point appropriate for data collection.
anomaly on sensors. Probe away. This is one of the chosen data collection nav points. We should release a probe. The data collection probe is prepped whenever you're ready, Ryder. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. Intense scourge activity is common in this area. Might be worth planting a probe. The data collection probe is prepped whenever you're ready, Ryder. Anomaly detected. Deploying probe. Intense scourge activity is common in this area. Might be worth planting a probe. We've arrived at a scourge nav point appropriate for data collection. Anomaly detected. Deploying probe. Intense scourge activity is common in this area. Might be worth planting a probe. Data collection probe ready for placement. Anomaly on sensors. Deploying probe. Intense scourge activity is common in this area. Might be worth planting a probe. The data collection probe is prepped whenever you're ready, Ryder. up something. Deploying probe. This is one of the chosen data collection nav points. 
We should release a probe. The data collection probe is prepped whenever you're ready, Ryder. Approximating remnant ship dynamics. Sam? Building predictive model. Between the remnant city Meridian and however the Scourge fits in, pardon my Martian, but it's all weird as shite. Seems busy up here. Did I get what we needed? You got us something, all right? The key to it all. In here. The mother of all navigational aids. Take that back to the remnant city, find an override, and their ships will fly the same vector as Meridian. With correction for the Scourge, you'll have its exact location. The heart of the Vault Network. We can do it. coming back here now. We're different. We're ready. Sam's marked a potential override for remnant ship control. A tower with its own energy grid. It may be one of the controls that deployed Meridian, and the means to find it again. And maybe, just maybe, we get lucky. For once. Ready? It's a lot to process, but we earned it. Everything we worked for led to this. <sighs> Tempest, we're going in. Quiet so far, but something's different. Orbital scans identified a separate energy grid within the tower. Meaning... Defenses here may not be on our side. 145 meters to projected override controls. Through the door. Eyes open. Remnant, and they don't look friendly. On it! More incoming! They do not want to give up this space! Was tougher than usual. We must be close to the controls we need. Let's move. Last remnant door. Controls are ahead. Projections suggest multiple launch bays and possible links to Meridian deployment. Don't waste any time. It's right there. We just need to apply the override, and the remnant will show the way. Sam, everything ready? All relevant data is queued for uplink. Right. Let's find a path. Thank you. 
Remnant ships have lifted off. They're following the override vector. The Scourge is moving, but they're getting through to... something. Meridian Pathfinder. Is that a planet? It looks... constructed. It's hollow. Like a Dyson sphere, but moon-sized. A self-contained seed world. It is the heart of the Vault Network, and when reactivated, every connected planet will be affected. It is the means to make Helios a home, Pathfinder. This is the day everyone in the Initiative has hoped and worked for. Ever since we left our own stars. Congratulations, Pathfinder. A great day for us all. Sam? Sam, what? What's going on? I believe you are fitting my rival. But you are a false thing. A lie. Once I saw what made you special, your connection. I knew how and when to take it from you. I let you find Meridian. And now, I'll use your Sam to weaponize it. All Helios will be exalted, or one by one, your worlds will die. Starting with Eos. All I need to start is an implant like yours. And thanks to your memories, I know who else has one. Another reason to take the Hyperion. Fall to darkness, Pathfinder. You are almost worthy. Keep going. The med bay is still secure. What the hell is happening? I wish I knew. Hello, Sarah. Sam? How are you? What's happening out there? They're shooting people. Cat forces are sweeping the ship. They're looking for you. Sarah, the Pathfinder needs your help. This is crazy. He's closing on Meridian. The Archon has severed my link to your brother's implant. If basic function isn't manually restored, he will die. What? Sarah, please, proceed to Depot K4 to secure a weapon. God damn it. Contact Sam, come on! The Archon isn't stealing the Hyperion. He wants you and me. Your implant is the same as the Pathfinder's. He'll use us to control Meridian, and your brother will die. The Archon will kill him? No, losing me will. What? Sam? Hostiles are ahead, Sarah. You ready? I am sorry I can't help you fight. I took over too much of your brother's implant, and losing me will kill him. So when the comms dropped, he did too? Hurry, Sarah. trouble. That's all we need to hear. Hold them! Saren needs to get to that maintenance access. Son, you can't keep this up. Then make it quick. Get to the QEC. God damn it, get going! That was tough. Get to that relay before more can't find us. Okay, we're here. One pulse, Sarah. That's all the Pathfinder needs. And a 
Probably alerts the Archon. He'll know where I am. I am sorry. Me too, Sam. Me too. Nyad Shuri! remnant. You need Sam to do anything. We need to get back. <laughs> Don't. It's hurting you. We'll find another way. We need to get back. Ryder, enough! I can do this. I don't believe it. You... Uh, are you okay? To the Tempest. We have to move! <laughs> Try it now. Pathfinder. Come on. We're here, Tempest. I got him. I got... Hey! Pathfinder! Kit took down the comms and hijacked the Hyperion. I know. The Archon's been planning since his flagship. He used me. Tell Doc that Ryder is hurt and doing weird stuff without Sam. Shite! Shite! We're getting reports from everywhere. All remaining catch ships are on the move. It's all the Archon. If he takes Meridian, he'll destroy worlds. Starting with Eos. He thinks he's won. Pathfinder. It kind of feels like he has. Ryder, there you are. You need to stop doing this. Nice to see you too. News on the Ark? Still headed to Meridian with a small flotilla. You got the last signal before the Archon locked it down. We're not letting that stand. Be ready to move. Wait, we need a plan. Stop ship. Kill jerk. With what? Maybe we're outgunned, but there's always a way. There's... Okay. He's got the Hyperion. That's how many thousand hostages? How many worlds does he destroy if we don't move? And how many do we save if we get ourselves killed? Well, we have to do something, right? I know, but the Tempest is one ship and she isn't even armed. an impossible thing. Can you keep that up? Have them fight for us? Cat are tough, but Remnant hit hard. The promise of that could inspire others to join in across the cluster. We have a for real shot at this. Rally the troops for a last stand. We're not throwing anyone's lives away, but the Remnant give us a chance worth taking. Right? Right. Is this where I give a speech? Ask you to die for me? No thanks. 
I say we shove the remnant down the Archon's throat. And maybe that buys us a chance. All of us. We get the whole cluster to pile on. Everyone in Helios has earned some fucking payback. Everyone is worked up, Pathfinder. But I need to talk. Meet me on the bridge. Make sure they're prepped. We'll see. Ground experience. No risk in You're sure the commanders are willing? Good to hear. Nice speech. You've inspired the entire crew. They're running around like monkeys getting ready for the big showdown. But not you, apparently. You inspire me, Ryder. In ways that are surprising even to me. I've got Remtech repurposed all over the place. And Pox souped up and raring to go. We'll keep you in one piece. I don't like seeing you suffer. Without Sam, it looks like interfacing with the Remnant hurts. A lot. It would hurt a lot more, without you. I'll let the schmaltz go, because I want a kiss after all this. Just a kiss? I like that I make you greedy. It is beautiful, isn't it? This weapon, it created life, and yet... Only I see its full potential, and I even have the means to achieve it, using you. I saw you from my flagship in the Pathfinder's memories. You have an implant, and a connection. And with that connection, I'll take Meridian. And then Helios will surrender, or burn. He'll get nothing from me. My brother will stop you. <laughs> we'll know soon enough, because your Pathfinder is already here. You continue to defy your limitations. Impressive. You okay? He's crazy. If we don't submit, he'll use Meridian to kill everyone. That's why he took me and Sam. You say that as though I should feel guilty. Exaltation is a gift. Those who can't see that deserve to die. You still command, Remnant, but that began with the Sam and the Implant, and now I have both. I no longer need you, Pathfinder, but since you insist on interfering, I'll give you my full attention. Got this. They're closing all sides. We need cover. Hug the remnant. Rock in a hard place. Ryder? Ryder! When your back's against the wall, if you can't run from it, use it. Stop running. And use it. Callum, how close can you edge the scourge? Too close? Why? Bring us in tight so I can group the remnant. We're using the Cluster's biggest headache to our advantage.
there to see that stuff. Get the Hyperion. Archon, don't blame your people. This clusterfuck is all you. I'm not playing your games anymore. You wish to force my hand. So be it. Unlike you in the Pathfinder, I do not require you. I have you. You've made this much more difficult, Pathfinder. But not for me. from last known position. It wasn't built for landing. We'll beat it down, like it or not. Wherever the Archon goes to ground, that's where we're heading. Hot drop in five, four, three. Chase him with the Ark at risk. We'll guard the Hyperion. Kandros, who's with you? The whole damn cavalry. You know I can't resist the party. We hold the cat, you secure Meridian. Let's find the Ark. Captain Dunn? The core is lit up like Christmas, but Sam isn't talking. I think the Archon... Shit, I don't know what he did, but he has Sarah. Whatever Meridian can do, he'll try to take it. Just focus on flying. I'll find them. Hard starboard. All power. Captain. Captain, what is it? Keep pushing. Go! That's not the Hyperion. Ken are deploying to defend the Archon. Get in close. Dangerous tactic, Kandros. He's right. Mix with the ground troops. The big ship can't fire on you. Not sure we have a choice. Debris incoming. Sorry for the mess. Structures ahead, Pathfinder, and major energy signals. I'm no Sam, but that's got to be some kind of control. We go through on foot. The Archon's not taking this place. The Archon must be inside already. He'll use Sarah to make Meridian a weapon. We can't let that happen. Dropship, heads up. Your own reinforcements on site, Pathfinder. The resistance is with you. Always up for the adventure, or whatever this is. Watch out, Pathfinder. The big cat ship is coming back around. Keep moving. We can't let them stop us. I think it's veering off. Multiple groups joining the fight. 
It's all or nothing. the fight inside, Pathfinder. We'll protect the Hyperion, but that only matters if you can catch the Archon. Understood, Pathfinder. Tempest, we're going in after the Archon. I'll relay the layout to anyone following. Whoa, energy spike. The Archon is doing something in there. Standing by. Sarah may need attention. Pathfinder. We're pulling together, can you believe it? It won't matter if the Archon gets control and blows up worlds. All I want is a straight up fight. Not strictly true. Save the pedantry for the victory party. The orders are clear. It is the space of the Archon. The Archon is stopped. The Archon is stopped. Understood, but we require new forces. Those pillars don't seem structural. Is this all Meridian? You know what the Remnant can do. How many worlds are on there? Right up the 
generator. Pathfinder, multiple system failures on the Hyperion. Damn it. Done. Done. Is there anything we can do? Stay out of our way. There's no pulling up. This is the captain. I need everyone to cryo. Go. 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 I'm rerouting power to all med bay inertials. I can give us one shot. Get me close enough and I'll biotically shield the bridge. The sleepers take priority. Brace. And it's been an honor to serve. Ugh. Captain Dunn? Captain Dunn! Still here, Ryder. Cryopods intact. Give the Pathfinders my thanks. And the Archon, the tip of your boot. Everyone listening? That landing means humanity's staying long term. And this just became a fight for the home front. No argument, Ryder. You have our support. Pathfinder, it's your honor to take that response to the Archon. First cat of the Hyperion, make them pay! Keep control. No mistakes. Your vessel is now in the Pathfinder. Collection and exaltation is now that much easier. And not you. You will never have our feet. The Archon demands you die here. Deploy to the guard arc system. Gentle. Shoring up defenses, Ryder. You okay up there? Kick their teeth in, if they have them. Secure like we're staying. Next stop, the Archon. Shoring up defenses, Ryder. You okay up there? Kick their teeth in, if they have them. Secure like we're staying. Next stop, the Archon. How far can we go in before we're heading out? Halfway. I asked for that. Do it. Secure the adaptation matrix. The Archon? How's he still on our channel? He's in Sarah's head. We're... connected. Remnant, but not attacking. The hell? It's pointing, guiding us. That can't be the Archon. Anyone see that? Doors closing? Does the Archon have that kind of control already? Who else would it be? More doors. Maybe. Sarah's found a way to help. Ryder, using Remnant hurts you. Prepare to repeat the cortical stimulus. Get out of my head! You are irrelevant. I will use your connection. God damn it! Wells are not supposed to be horizontal. Our home's parked on the surface. We can't stop now. No choice. Let's go. Look at all this. It's amazing. 
Never dreamed Andromeda would have so many wonders. If I'd known, I'd have worked even harder. We can't let the Archon take this. Touchdown. And ahead? Already in control? A long time coming. Six hundred years. Ready, Pathfinder? It's a gateway to everything we've been chasing. Never been more ready. Hell yeah. is ready. I can feel it. There. Meridian. The network. So close. We need to move. Come on. My clues? How you feeling, Sarah? Is this what you do? It hurts a lot. So determined, but so pointless. Your connection serves me. I know how it works. The mind is trained to think like the remnant creators. In this case, painfully. But I'm content to let her bear that burden. Whatever gives me Meridian, I will transcend what you pretend to be. You're out of time. I've matched you every step. You failed, Archon. You're the pretender. You learn by accident. I am the genetic inheritor of a thousand species. No more mercy. Kill them all. Sarah's implants. Can they survive drawing this much power? I only care about one of them. Fighting me. I don't have your practice. Assisting. Sam? 
I am still restricted, but the more remnants you destroy, the more fractured the Archon's attention. Hold position! Kick his tail! <laughs> 
Pathfinder. Smile for the camera, babe. Sam's broadcasting, everyone's watching. They all want a nice big close-up of the hero who single-handedly saved the galaxy. What about you? And now they all know you're mine.
Hey, Sarah. I'm getting too used to this. How long? Weeks. Relax. You haven't missed much. The Ark and the Sleepers, they're safe in the Sphere? You better like where we parked, because it's home now. The Sleepers wake to an amazing view. We did it, Dad. What about your implant and Sam? I am once again helping the Pathfinder activate Remnant. Our connection has been restored to normal. Normal? You need him again? I'll take the help. I was turning my brain inside out. That is exceptionally inaccurate. Well, it felt like it. Didn't it, Sarah? The Nexus leaders are waiting, Pathfinder. Duty calls. Better not keep them waiting. It never ends. Go on. I need some rest. The decision isn't yours. Neither is it yours. That is the point, isn't it? Pathfinder, you're late. Save the cluster, straight back to work. I get it. It must seem like that, but this wouldn't be possible without you. As outposts become colonies, the cluster needs its own voice. A true council. And while I maintain that it is premature, we must nominate an interim ambassador to represent concerns outside the Nexus. Or rather, you must nominate someone. I can handle a hot potato, but why throw it to me in the first place? Because we need it to be legitimate. We can't impose a vote on the Angar. Or even Kadara. Eladin? <laughs> Won't happen. But you've acted for everyone. If you endorse a name, some may disagree, but they will trust it as a starting point. Someone to speak for Helios. I put forward Pathfinder Hager. I'd suggest you, but someone might think you killed the Archon to elevate yourself. We can't allow the appearance of that. But Hager keeps the position, and the timeline, in the Nexus family. The Angara need to help define the process. It's their right. Plus, the Moshai would help solidify relations. We're already partnered, thanks to your efforts against the Rokar. All the more reason to focus on our own issues. If we're going to treat Helios like a home, we need to acknowledge whose home it is. I won't name anyone. I support asking the Moshai to act as interim ambassador. Meridian's opening day, and we're surrendering how much influence? That's the point, you colonial ward. Sarah is feeling better? Good. This decision, the policy and protocol, that's not what your victory was about. There's more to life than this. Integration of Hyperion systems is ongoing. Our SAM node will be accessible on return visits to Meridian. Ryder, enjoying the fruits of your labor? You deserve it. Thanks, Callow. The Tempest is getting some much needed service. I thought I'd leave them to it. But I wouldn't miss the big day. Meridian looks so different out of the cockpit. I think I understand better why you do what you do. Finding Meridian crystallized a lot of things about being a Pathfinder. I expect many around here are thinking about their own potential. I don't pretend to understand everything, but Meridian must have opened a lot of doors. Not all of them safe. I want you to know that it'll be my privilege to keep flying you to them. I can't do this without a good pilot. Or a great pilot. How about a pilot determined to help his friends? I've learned a lot from you, Ryder. And Gil. Don't... please don't tell him that. Things will change now, but that's all right. Nothing's ever really lost. Up straight, everyone. This is the guest of honor. Well, like you have to tell anyone that. Hunter, this is our opening. Let there be some sense of ceremony. As I was about to say, hello, Pathfinder. I am Chief of Operations, Ayorapile. Second Wave Placements Officer, Darlavas Hyperion. 
Hunter Carey, reconstruction. Hunter Kelly, can I get some clarification on reconstruction? Sure thing. I'm tasked with turning this once proud vessel into the future proud human capital. It's more complicated than that. No, it's a structural and organizational nightmare. Which is job security, which is perfect. Come back in a year. This will be a galactic hub. You won't know where the Hyperion ends and Meridian begins. This is the first I've heard of the term second wave. It isn't literal. There have been several groups deployed for outposts. Second wave is about the staged evolution of the initiative. First wave out of cryo, structural support and generalists. Food and fences. Second wave is organizational. Less generalists, more specialists. More paperwork. It's needed to rapidly advance. I'm not spending a generation on the range. Ayora Pillay, you're in charge of Meridian? That's a big statement. I will oversee the operations and establishment of our port. Exploration and study of the... interesting substructure will be handled by Initiative R&D. I'm told that may take lifetimes. We'll ensure that we have them. That's what I trained for. Darla Vos Hyperion, placements officer? As our developments in the cluster grow more sophisticated, proper matching of sleeper and assignment will be vital. My mission is to ensure compatibility and fulfillment. When are you changing your name to Vast Meridian? I keep Vast Hyperion to honor the ship that brought us here, as my godparents would want. Just saying we're staying. Please forgive Hunter. He is an ass. Sounds like Meridian is in good hands. I can only read the reports of how you brought us this opportunity, but rest assured, we will not waste it. Yes. Thank you, Pathfinder. Aye, what they said. Thank you, Pathfinder. I'll pay it forward, I swear. Arc Hyperion, departed Milky Way 2185, arrived Andromeda 2819. Current status recorded as Meridian. Well, narrator guy is getting work. Please select a topic. The transformation of Arc Hyperion into Port Meridian continues both above and below the surface. This includes the planned integration of initiative and remnant technologies, pending further research. Port Meridian is currently powered by repurposed Tantalus drive cores, which require the frequent discharge of static energy. This causes a unique visual phenomenon during Meridian's night cycle that has been dubbed Aurora Meridiani. While decommissioned as a vessel, the superstructure silhouette of Arc Hyperion will be maintained in perpetuity. All internal structures are being adapted for sleeper deployment and future industrial and residential development. These internal structures have been designated as Port Meridian. The Hyperion was shepherded to its resting place by a coalition of allies who stood as one against the Ket Archon. Pathfinder Scott Ryder spearheaded the defense and remains assigned to Arc Hyperion despite its reclassification. Landing day has been proposed as a cluster-wide holiday. Status, pending. Arc Hyperion has been declared a monument to those who lost their lives in service of the initiative. A plaque has been placed at the highest point of the Hyperion superstructure. It reads, We turned our backs upon a dwindling star to chase a dawn beyond our childhood's end. <laughs> so this is how you all party, hmm? <laughs> Pretty tame, but don't tell the host I said that. Meridian is amazing, though. You... accomplished the inconceivable. I'm grateful to be part of it. No, I'm grateful. I couldn't have asked for a better team. We created this together. And exactly what it is, what it may become. <laughs> I can't even imagine to think that when we met, the Angara and your initiative struggled to find trust. The way we arrived on Aya was over the top. You know, uninvited and on fire. <laughs> Agreed. 
<laughs> Guess it worked out okay. <sighs> Ryder, the Angara will never forget how you saved the Moshai. But more than that, we'll never forget how you fought the Ket beside us. How we destroyed the Archon. Meridian is a new beginning for your people and mine. Together. New beginnings. That's what I came to Helios for. And what I dreamed of. Yes. <laughs> new beginnings. So, let's get to it. Hey, Ryder. How's Sarah? Much better. There might be two Riders around soon. Imagine. The Hyperion's forming scientific teams. Gotta start studying what we have. I may have helped them organize. That'll be exciting. Meridian rewrites all kinds of physical laws. Maybe they'll name a new law after you. Something about never staying in one place? This is a new cradle for humanity. That's a big idea. Bigger than I'd imagined. So maybe building those teams was smart. Small steps to understand all this. Until we're at the top of the mountain. And seeing the next horizon. Can't deny it. I'm game for more. With so much power in our hands, you think it'll be okay? Cora, sometimes you just have to leap out there and see where it takes you. Yeah, I guess you do. Whatever happens, you gave everyone an incredible gift. Nice job, Pathfinder. I'm waiting for my wife to be brought out of cryo. Then I really start. Well, if it isn't the hero of the hour. You were pretty heroic yourself. I have my moments. Guess you'll be heading out soon? Still a lot to do. Meridian's just one step toward making Helios our home. Yeah, but a damn big one. You deserve to celebrate. And I deserve another drink. Cheers, Pathfinder. Pathfinder. I'm told I'm about to get exceptionally busy. Which, given your health, is unwise. We all gave of ourselves, Ephra. It was time. And as this ambassador, I will continue to do so. No other choice made sense. That isn't true. There were choices that made sense for others. Also, don't assume my name brings universal approval. You know how varied our opinions can be. I can't speak for everyone, but I will gladly help create the system that does. And Sala Venjuri, Pathfinder. There is much yet to learn. The last thing they said before Cryo dropped. Scott, kept a seat for you. In your planet, that's not getting less weird. About time Iridium got a proper grand opening. We all need this. Heard Sarah woke up. How's she doing? She'll be back on duty in no time. Too soon, if we let her. So, you're telling me you're having trouble explaining limits to a rider? Hey, know who I just talked to? A second wave technician, fresh out of cryo. Just had his first sunrise in Andromeda. He couldn't stop crying. Just him? <laughs> uh, must be something going around. Maybe you're the carrier. It's really feeling like home, you know? Finally. They haven't given you five minutes alone since the fight. Have you had a chance to let it sink in? There's so much here. It'll be years before we even know where to start. Don't need starters. Starters are a dime a dozen. We need finishers. And we have the best. I'm looking at you, Pathfinder Rider. The whole galaxy is. Cheers. So Tan says he's gonna let me stick around and help with the... Hey, Ryder. What's the word on the street? Ryder saves the day, Pathfinder of the Century. You know, the usual. Still? Get used to it. They're gonna name things after you when you die. And probably even before. So we heading out again soon? 
Oh, she's all grown up, leaving home, doesn't need me anymore. <laughs> That'll be the day. We'll handle my deals on this end while I'm gone. Seeing you two in cahoots <laughs> makes me all misty. You know this is your fault, right? Helping us along? Helis has really turned into the fresh start I wanted, in so many ways. And now with Meridian, we're really going to make this place ours. I can't wait. You know where to find me when you're ready. You ha- So glad you're up and around. I have important news for you. There always is. Yes, discoveries every day, but this is something we've been waiting for. Listen. What should I be hearing? Sorry, Sam. Active filtering. Initiative protocol Alpha Alpha to the screen. Protocol what? Processing. Repeating! This is the Ark Kirathia! The situation is not under control. Not and avoid until further update. Repeating! Is that? The Corian Ark. And Elcor? Drell Volus? Hanar, I think. That's some delicate business putting Hanar in stasis. Point is, they're still out there. The Kilasia wasn't destroyed. It's patchy, and there's no traceable vector, I assume? It bounced through the Scourge. I've doubled long-range probes, but... That's not a distress call. It's a warning to keep away from... wherever they are. Whatever's happening, they don't want to be found yet. We have to trust their Pathfinder. All we can do is wait. Heading out soon? Kid. Old man? Ha ha ha. This place is something else. We can finally start doing what we were supposed to do when we first got here. Explore. Speaking of that, I sent out the Mackmore scouts. Nearly drowned me in reports until I pointed them at Tan. Told him to be extra wordy just for him. He'll love that. He wanted the job, he can have the reports. It's not over, you know. There'll be more Ket and whatever else is waiting out there. I know, right? It's going to be so much fun. Ha, <laughs> crazy kid. Fighting for all the right reasons. You're right, it'll be fun. Hiya. Meridian, huh? I see it every day, and I'm still amazed. We're really starting to put down roots. It's wonderful. Did I tell you? The team's working with the Angara to set up a joint research body. That sounds exciting. I know. I can't wait. Us helping them, them helping us. Can you imagine what we could accomplish? <sighs> I'm getting all misty just thinking about it. This was always what was intended. Nice to be here, finally. We always knew what we wanted, but for a while we couldn't see it. Now it's here, it's happening, and it's beautiful. Look who it is. Well, hello. Hello yourself. Eyes front, try not to swoon. I want you... I want you more. I need proof. Soon. Well, let's get this show on the road. Meridian looks great, but, you know, been there, done that. Hey, this was a big accomplishment. It's important to enjoy it. Don't get me wrong. I'm proud of us. Helios is changing, and will be for a long time. I'm just antsy. Don't want to miss a thing. Oh, I almost forgot. The device we got out of the volcano? Gil thinks it might someday allow me to program real personality into Pockin's app. That's all I need. A robot cracking wise while I'm in a firefight. Oh, you're always so serious. Enjoy the moment. We're here to celebrate, remember? Look who's talking, Miss Basale. Just keeping you on your toes. For now, you're right. The galaxy isn't going anywhere. Let's have some fun. Still standing? Still standing. Then I did my job. Somehow. Nothing more need be said. 
I'll remember that the next time you chew me out for getting hurt. So will I, Ryder. So will I. Pathfinder, thanks for the invite to the party. I didn't organize anything. Not this. Landing day. That was worth jumping galaxies. Hey, Ryder. Jill is walking the walk. The procedure took. I'm gonna be a dad. Congratulations. I'm thinking Mary if it's a girl, Deanne if it's a boy. Mary. Deanne, Marie Deanne, pretty cool, right? Jill might have something to say about that. Oh, right, note to self, bounce names off Jill. So this is supposed to be a celebration, right? You getting used to any of this yet? Meridian, the dream becoming a reality? We're not done by a long shot. Come on, try to ease up a little, enjoy the win. But so you know, I've got the Tempest topped out and ready. You want to blow this hot dog stand? Just say the word. Callow's out there somewhere, time one on. If we're really sneaky, he won't even notice we're gone. Who's flying then? You? Why the hell not? I'm a quick study. How hard can it be? You better get this nonsense out of your system in the next nine months, you know. <laughs> Little Mary's gonna have a fun dad. Looking good, Ryder. Oh. <clears throat> Leaving so soon? Figured I'd leave before I teared up. No one needs to see that. Some may want to see exactly that. To know you feel the same as they do. I'm new to this role myself. The training didn't cover how to honor your peers. There's no protocol. Your father invented this role, but you defined it. This is great and all, but it feels weird to be on a ship that isn't moving. We're explorers. There's more to see out there. Let's go find it. Sam, that's... 100% viability on all known UNCs, Pathfinder. Please access the Tempest VidCon for an important update. Tempest VidCon? All right. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. Lexi, I hear Sarah's doing well. How much we'll get done with two riders? I can't wait. There's a new task because we hit 100% viability? It is a significant milestone, Pathfinder. Preparations have been made for some time. 
I need to know if there's another expectation because of this. Updating objectives. You have a high priority destination. At Habitat 7? What's going on? I have been instructed to not reveal mission parameters. Don't be late, Pathfinder. Well, writer does lead us to in there's anywhere more interesting than Meridian? If there is, we'll find out. We're in stable orbit. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. I found something. Anomaly detected. Deploying probe. Anomaly found. Anomaly detected. Probe away. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. up something. Probes launched. Anomaly found. So, back at Habitat 7. What am I supposed to see? And what's it got to do with 100% viability? I'm getting initiative signals. Magnetosphere charges and atmosphere probes. The vault here remains non-functional, but with 100% viability to invest, we've begun terraforming this world with initiative technology. The good old-fashioned hard way. 
It'll eventually be a home too, thanks to you. Back where we started. Fitting. There is one more item, Pathfinder. Opening channels to the Nexus. Meridian. Podromos. Detaion. Tevuni. New Tachanka. And Initiative Allies. By unanimous vote, this world is to be renamed. Habitat 7 is now listed astronomically as Rider 1. Your world, Pathfinder. Their future.